y'all it's your girl kai and i am back with another video thank you guys so much for tuning in if you are new here what's up it's your girl kai go ahead and hit that like comment and subscribe because we get lit over here okay period so i know y'all have already checked out the title of this video we are going to be doing the long awaited fall try on haul i had to make sure i had all the pieces everything that was trending right now some more different stuff as well for me to cop so y'all could see me do this awesome try on haul okay and now we are in november it's november already like i, I don't know about y'all but october just flew right on by so it is time we are about to get into this fall try on haul i have a ton of pieces i have some pieces from fashion nova and shein as well i'll let you guys know all my sizes and everything as well as the name of each item just in case y'all want to go cop and also the link for every item Item that I show in this will be down in the description box so y'all can go get these trends okay so we aren't gonna waste any more time we're just gonna get right into it thank you guys so much for tuning in like comment and subscribe we'll wait all right so now that y'all done that let's go ahead and get right into this video okay so first things first we are gonna get right into this haul disclaimer your girl is 5'3 and 100 and pounds let me stop i'm between like 170 180 pounds and i'm 5'3 there okay everything that i got is surprisingly in a medium but anyway like i said 5'3 170 75 pounds depending on what day it is okay so let's go ahead and get right into it the first items that i'm going to be showing you are these she in basic dresses i also got everything in a size medium everything is in a medium everything that you are seeing is in a medium so these i got two she in basic dresses they come really they come down really long they're like a turtleneck i call them a turtleneck because they're not necessarily a mock neck i feel like a mock neck comes down just a tad lower but these are true turtlenecks they actually come all the way up on my neck i got it in this pretty chocolatey brown color and i also got it of course in black because i just feel like during the fall everybody needs that basic throw on turtleneck dress like literally you can dress it up and dress it down you can do it with heels you can do it with sneakers you can do it with amazing jewelry jackets you can really just accessorize these basics up and definitely make them your own so you already know i had to cop them in black and brown i was gonna go for gray but honestly not that i'm trying to get away from gray but i'm really trying to get more into black and brown because i just know i'm already into black i'm really just trying to get more into browns because i feel like brown is that fall color that i constantly miss out on when it gets cool outside i immediately go to gray and black and that's it gray black and maybe some white i really wanted to incorporate brown into my wardrobe this season so anyway back to these dresses they are pretty thin but they're not the thin cheap material that you can see straight through them they are very you can't see through them however they are thin so i would not expect for these to keep me warm at all if i do decide to wear these out i'm gonna wear you know of course a thick bra probably some spanks underneath and stuff like that just to smooth me out as well as keep me warm so if you're expecting these to keep you warm girl go ahead and layer up with socks and a coat because it's not going to do that this material is thin but it's not see-through so i absolutely love the black one and the brown one i went ahead and washed all these items before i even tried them on but anyway i absolutely love both of of these the black and the brown um the only difficulty that i was having is that they did not label the necks so that i could tell what the front and what the back was but y'all know when you look at it you could kind of tell which one's the front and which one's the back so these are not very see-through but they're thin so don't expect them to keep you warm so i got these in black and brown and they are both in a size 
medium. Okay, the next thing I got, um, I also got in a medium. It's a sweater and it has like these pearls on the sleeve. It's like a, a flare sleeve and there are pearls on it. I absolutely had to have this. I thought it was just so cute and elegant. Oh my goodness. And I was like, if they ever come out with a red one, I'm definitely gonna get the red one for Christmas time. But I definitely thought that this was just so cute and just elegant for fall. So let's talk about she in sweaters. I feel like everyone has been wondering about the sweaters and the quality of them. These are good sweaters. They're actually sweater material. They're not see-through or anything like that. It's a real sweater material. It's not any type of cheap spandexy. I don't know what other imitation sweater out there but it's not that it is a true sweater material and it's nice and thick and warm and also the pearls on here are put on in very good quality the only thing that I didn't really care for was y'all see on this side on this side there aren't that many pearls but on this side, all the pearls are here. So I do wish that it was the it was an even amount of pearls on all angles and all sides. Oh, but this one, okay, so this sleeve has pearls evenly all around it. But this one is missing. Like it doesn't have it's bare it's barely any pearls right here. Y'all see that? It's like they forgot to put the pearls up in here. So that is one thing that I didn't care for. And now I'm looking at it, I'm like, dang, they really did put all the pearls on this one. But anyway the pearls are not sewn on they're bolted in so there's a little silver piece on the inside and then the pearl sits on the outside so I actually liked that it wasn't stitched in because I feel like if you were to lose one then it would rip the shirt up but if it's a bolt like it's like a little bolt thingy if it does come out and you lose a pearl you know it'll just be gone and it'll just be blank there which I'm perfectly okay with but I thought this color this was an interesting color I do wish they had some more colors in it but you know she and they'll drop colors out of nowhere this is very cute it's very soft i absolutely love it it's just so elegant i can't even explain what color this is because at first i was like it's giving purple but then i was like no it's giving gray so it's whatever color you want to call it but once again this is in a size medium and this sweater is just so freaking cute like how could you not so love this on to the next okay next thing i got is this sweater so so this sweater was really cute to me I was like, oh my gosh, I could definitely wear this with maybe some boyfriend jeans or something like that or some mom jeans. And so across like on the elbows, I'm sorry y'all, it's lint everywhere. You probably can't even see it, but it is lint <laughs> everywhere from these clothes because the sweater material. So it's just fl stuff floating in the air, like literally. So I, I really like this. The only thing that I didn't like about this is the turtleneck. And then I was like, well, maybe I got it too small. So I got this in a medium, right? But I didn't realize what crop sweaters it comes up in the front and drops down in the back so with it coming up in the front it's giving under boob but you can see my bra and that's not cute so it's giving under boob and then also the neck i was like maybe i should i should have definitely gotten this in a large because literally you'll see it's stitching is like down here for the turtleneck and then the turtleneck only comes up half my neck like it looks really really weird and i was like maybe i could finesse this i I don't know because it's so cute i really like the color i love the sleeves i love that it's a crop i was like maybe i could like finesse it or stretch it but i will say by far this was one of the only product products that i actually just like had a problem with i would say yeah so i'm sorry y'all i'm looking in my mirror here i really love this sweater i was looking forward to this sweater this crop sweater but it just i'll say it doesn't fit i'll keep it above and just say it doesn't fit i'm not gonna sugarcoat it or go around it this doesn't fit okay i should have just got a large because then the neck would have been big enough to actually be like a turtleneck and then the bottom could have actually been a crop that doesn't show my bra and stuff like that so this was a miss even though it's super super cute i wish i could finesse it let's i have no idea how i could possibly finesse this the only way i could see myself finessing this is if i put like a tank top underneath but we like to show skin because you know we never get cold period that's that on this one this one eh if you're gonna get this, definitely size up, I would say, just so you'll have that length in the front and so you can have that actual turtleneck on your neck. So on to the next. The next thing I got, oh my gosh, y'all, I absolutely love this. I got this jacket and it is just so stinking cute. 
cute. Like, I feel like Mary had a little lamb. I feel like Mary had a little lamb. It's white. The picture showed that it's white. It's white, okay? It's not eggshell or anything like that. It is white. And it's, of course, the Sherpa material. I love this jacket. It is so cute. And I feel like in the picture, it didn't show it as a crop. I don't recall it being a crop, but on me, it's a crop. And it's so cute. I love this jacket. Because I thought it was cute on the model, but when I got it and actually put it on, I was like, oh, baby, this is giving when i tell you it's giving it's giving i absolutely love this jacket i was like oh my gosh like because if you don't if you do or don't know i do not care what color the hardware is i actually prefer silver hardware on jackets because i feel like sometimes gold hardware if it's not a light enough gold if it's too much of a yellowy gold it can begin to look cheap but this is a silver hardware and you know i will definitely wear it with my gold jewelry that doesn't bother me i you know i'm not that um particular about it so i would definitely be wearing gold hardware with this but it's just the cutest jacket it, it's i'll say on a scale of one to ten how thick it is it's not a 10 like it's not gonna keep you super duper warm but once again like i told y'all i live in the south so we do it doesn't get that extremely cold down here so i don't need a super duper thick heavy jacket all the time but this jacket i'll say it's like a five on a scale of one to 10 it's like a good 50 50 as far as the thickness of it it's not completely thin and it's not you know gonna keep you warm on in a snowstorm you know so that's that on that but i absolutely love this jacket i got it in a medium if you did want it to get it bigger you know you go for a large depending on what type of look you want it but i still feel like it gives me like that it's it's weird it's cropped but it gives me that oversized look does that make sense it's gonna make sense today so but i absolutely love this jacket 10 out of 10 and it's very well constructed because that's what i was looking for when it came to winter stuff i know we're all used to buying stuff off of shein during the summer time and you know everybody's okay with little thin you know whatever whatever summer clothes but when it comes to winter clothes we really want good quality clothes so this jacket is a very good quality especially for the price so on to the next okay so the next thing i got um it has like lint on it because it was sitting over there with all my sweaters and what have you so uh that's one thing i don't really care for about this um it's a lint catcher but this is it's just a unitar it's a long sleeve turtleneck black unitar okay real spy gear sis real spy gear everybody needs unitards or uh cat suits unitard unitards or cat suits whatever you call them these are my go-to during the winter time if you haven't seen my fall essentials definitely go check them out i am a cat suit girl i am a unitard girl during the winter time because it's just like you just put the whole thing on and then you just layer with jackets and boots and what have you so i absolutely love this this is the unitard it's all black um it does have thumb holes in it as well it just fits really really nice i just don't like that it is a lint catcher that's very hard to deal with i thought it was gonna be the material like my other one is like that spandexy stretchy material that's smooth that's what i thought it was gonna be this is giving more of a cotton material so it's kind of annoying that it does catch lint and it just it's not shiny it's really like a cotton suit but that's fine with me i mean i i just needed it as a basic like a basic go-to and it's not like slinky it's not a slinky material it is just what it is okay so i did get this in a medium as well it was long enough on the arms and the feet for me with me being 5'3 i just hate that it's a link catcher so i'm literally when i wear this i gotta pick strategically what jacket i'm gonna wear with it because this gonna catch all the lint this is going to catch all the lint but once again i just really needed one of these this is definitely gonna be an essential go-to for me for the winter because it's quick to put on it's black zips up and down sporty and you you can wear it on the go so i like this black unitar and i got in a medium as well so speaking of unitards let's talk about this unitar this unitar this unitar out of this one and the black one this one last was my favorite so like i said i'm trying to get more into the nudes and the browns for this fall season because i usually don't 
dilly dally in those areas of browns and nudes but this new jumpsuit oh my gosh it's so cute it's everything it has thumb holes and on the hands it says lucky label and i just like that it's not really like huge and noticeable because i honestly didn't even notice that it says something on the hands but it's not bad and it also comes with thumb holes but this one is ribbed i didn't know that it was ribbed when i bought it and i usually don't care for ribbed stuff i like this ribbed i'll say that i liked this ribbed because at first i was like i don't like ribbed stuff but i actually like this ribbing the zipper is a very high quality nice zipper the seams everything okay this is on point this is a very very good quality unitar and it's in nude like you can't even go wrong with nude it just looks so nice on it just hugs my body but like i said now this one is not going to keep you warm i'll say the black one that has that's more of a cottony material that'll keep you warmer than this one this one is i feel like this one you can even go all the way to the spring and wear this you know because it's not that thick it's not heavy um it's not insulated it's really just kind of like that stretchy spandexy material but once again it's not cheap to wear it's see-through okay like you can't see your underwear through it and that's what we have been primarily looking for so i absolutely love this jumpsuit because y'all know like i said i am a cat suit girl i will buy cat suits to the end of the world this one is actually a turtle turtleneck this one comes all the way up and that just it just elevates the look because some of these like the black one i feel like when i zip it all the way up to my neck i look like i'm a spy but this one when i zip it all the way up to my neck I look like luxury. Like I said, got this in a medium. Absolutely love this unitar. I would highly, highly, highly recommend. Makes your booty look good too, girl. So the next two items that I purchased are actually from Fashion Nova. Everybody knows about these dresses because Fashion Nova has the best version of this dress. I was going to get this dress from Shein, but just looking at the quality from Fashion Nova to Shein as far as these dresses, now sometimes you can put the two head to head and just go off of who has the best price of who you're going to shop with but in this case i actually could tell that fashion nova had a better quality than she did so that's why i went to fashion nova to purchase these dresses these are the kellyan kellyan killian sweater dresses the, these dresses go off the shoulder everybody has seen these dresses y'all would you believe that it has been i've been trying to get the pink one in my hands for like maybe like a year and a half that's how long it's taking me to get my hands on this pink one so when i got the opera when they first uploaded this again and said hey we got the Kellyanne back in pink you know I had to snag this bad boy you know I had to so I got it in pink and it's pink like bubble gum and that's I just love it and actually it's very very thick I literally think that I could have went a size down in this I got it my usual size of a medium but you could actually go a size down if you want to if you just wanted to hug your curves even more because I do wish it was a little more snug so it could hug my curves just a little better but it's hugging it's thick you know so I love this dress I also got it in black so I had to get it in black because I always have to have my basics especially in in the fall i need because there'll be plenty of days where the weather be bad or i have no idea what to wear so i'm gonna grab something black and keep it pushing so i got both of these in a size medium and i got it in pink and black absolutely love them highly 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 recommend i will say if you're going to get this off the shoulder dress this famous sweater off the shoulder dress i will go to fashion nova over shein for this dress because it's thicker and it's just a higher quality of material so that's my take on these okay so the next dress y'all let me tell you about this dress let me tell you what i went through with this dress okay so i saw it on shein actually i had seen an insta girl wear this dress last year so basically it's just like you could say it's a long cardigan but it's a dress and it's fitted so the buttons it goes to a v-neck and the buttons go all the way down and i saw an insta girl wear this dress i think maybe last year and all the searching that I did, I couldn't find the dress where it actually came down to the floor. Like, actually came down for real. Because I kept seeing the ones that were short. They were just an odd length. Have you ever seen some stuff that's like an odd length? It doesn't touch the floor and it doesn't go above your knees. But it's like in a weird area. But it's not a midi. Yeah, they had some of that going on. So, when I saw that Shein had this dress, I was like, oh my gosh, I need this dress. I kept checking back for months. Like, see if they had the dress in my size. Because it kept being sold out 
find a medium. And so one morning I just woke up, I said, let me see if they restocked it. And they have finally restocked it in the medium because it just kept getting sold out. So I finally got my hands on it, finally got my hands on another chocolate dress. Oh my gosh, y'all, I love this dress because everybody on the site was serving in this dress. That's how you know it's a good dress, when everybody serves in it, when it's just so beautiful and everybody, everybody type. Like, that's when you know that item is up to par. So, I literally love this dress. So the buttons do stop and then it just drags off, but it's still just so pretty. And I feel like you have to be careful not to get it too small because otherwise it'll do that button down and then fly open thing, that little where it's together and then it goes boom. You have to be careful that you're getting the correct size. I like that the B is not super duper deep as well. This is just such a pretty fall dress. Like, But like I said, this is not very thick. It's thin, but it's not see-through. But will it keep you warm? The answer is no. But I love this dress. It's so cute. It's so cute. Um, I got it in a medium. It's a size medium US 6. So highly, highly, highly recommend. On to the next. Okay, so this fall, I really got into my pink obsession because y'all know I like pink. I'm finally, I'm finally finding more pink things that are cute and that I like to purchase. So let me tell you about this shirt. I mean, this sweater. This sweater is thick, it's cozy, it's very good material. On Shein, you have to be careful. I feel like the price shows you the quality of this sweater. A lot of these sweaters that I picked out were maybe like 15 to $20 and up. So they're still a very good price, but they are hot just a little higher than the ones that are thinner. So this is a sweater. And I was worried about this because I was like, I don't want to look like a flying squirrel. But the girl in the picture just looks so freaking chic that I was just like, I have to wear it. It's bubblegum pink. I can't look like a flying squirrel or a granny in it because it's bubblegum pink. Now if it was brown, I would look, probably look like a flying squirrel. But I just love this sweater. Like I really didn't expect to love it this much, but the girl in the picture was serving it. Like, it was a look because usually I wouldn't get things like this because um, I was worried about it making me look a little bit on the heavier side, but I feel like it doesn't. It does, but it doesn't. It makes me look a little bit more mature, but it's just so chic. Like I don't even care because it's just so chic. And then it's pink. I feel like if it was in any other color, I wouldn't like it. If it was in any other color than pink, probably wouldn't like it. But because it's in bubblegum pink, it's cute. Mm-hmm. I'm picky, but I absolutely love it in the bubblegum pink color. Oh, do not size up in this because it is big. I feel like it is a little oversized, but it's not so oversized to where it's like, what on earth is happening? What is eating you? I got it in a medium, my true size, and it just fits so nice. It's so pretty. It's so elegant. Go cop! While we go to the next item. So the next thing I got is this green sweater. Now, another thing about this sweater. So like I said, um, this sweater is thick. It's a true sweater. It kept me warm when I wore it because I did already wear this to work because I was just like, oh, uh, let me save all my clothes for the haul before I wear them. But I was just like, I need something to wear. It's really cute. Now the picture, in the picture, you would think that it's off the shoulder, right? So the girl, she's sitting like in a stool and it looks like it's off the shoulder and it has a slip on the side that she's showing. What I didn't know was that there's only a slit on one side. It's only a slit on one side. There's no slit on the other side. So when I got it, I was like, why is there only a slit on one side and it's not even off the shoulder? So when I could tell about it from the perspective of the picture, it's not like the picture. It has a slit on the side, so you assume that there are slits on both sides, but it's not. And so I was a little, eh, I was like, eh, about that. But luckily the sweater is cute. The sweater is cute. Not gonna lie and say it's not. It's just not what was in the picture, okay? So it only has a slit on one side and because it only has a slit on one side and the other side is closed up it gives like this asymmetrical so it uh goes down like a diamond like so it is kind of like an asymmetrical look but it does not go off the shoulder no matter how hard you try maybe if i stretch out the neck a little more it'll go off the shoulder but it does not go off the shoulder i kind of wish it did maybe i'll continue to stretch it but this is a warm sweater okay a really good quality really nice wash is good and i'm like well maybe if i got a size up like maybe if i would have went to a large instead of a medium it would have been off the shoulder but still like i'm gonna get my true size but either way it's cute 
love the color on to the next so the next item is a dress so i feel like this dress they wore a lot like in the 90s i love this dress okay it's another nude dress it's a turtleneck now let me tell you this dress does look funny without a belt you need to belt this dress if you wear it without a belt i don't know it just looks funny without the belt because at first when i first took it out of the box and like put it on i was like <laughs> But then I, I realized that when I bought the dress, the lady in the picture had on a belt. It tells you that the belt does not come with it. So I was not misled about that. I knew I was just buying the dress. So the lady had on a belt in the picture and that's what made the dress look nice. So when I put it on and I couldn't figure out what was wrong with the dress, I was like, hmm. And then I was like, you have to wear a belt with this. Okay, so this is the dress. Um, It kind of got bent at the bottom, but this dress was giving me ultimate 90s vibe. Like I cannot wait to wear this with maybe like a brown lip. I cannot wait to pick out some more belts to even go with this. So I just slapped on a belt for the haul itself. I can't wait to really get a belt that would just accent and just give this as a look. I see the potential in this dress. You have to accessorize with this. If you think that you can just wear this dress plain, I mean, if you wear it plain and you serve by all means, but I feel like with this dress, you need to accessorize so that it will bring it out and really be seen for its place full potential but i love this dress once again this dress is thick i feel like this is my own personal opinion depending on the price will tell you if it's thick and nicely made or not when it comes to sweaters now when we was all blowing bags on Shein in the summertime it didn't matter what you bought it was all gonna be the same quality but when it comes to winter stuff if you want something thick it's gonna be on the higher end if it's thin then it won't cost as much and that's just what I think so this is real sweater it stretches across your boobies and it does not show your boobs through and it's just such a pretty color on my skin so I absolutely love this dress highly 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 recommend in and let's get into the last item so last but not least i want to say this is my favorite this is my favorite item out of this whole haul this shirt oh my gosh i was iffy about this shirt because on the model the material of it looked i don't know how to explain the material that it looks like what it looks like on the model i was actually happy to get it and it just be a regular ribbed sweater material i really want to get some more colors in this i don't know what made me go for orange i was like what's a fall haul without something orange so i got this it's off the shoulder it's very 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 well made so around the top part it's more elastic so it hugs really tight and it's thick it's very 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 well made to cinch so that it's not falling off and so i got this in a medium um if you need to go up a size i would because when you take it out it looks really really small it looks really tiny when you take it out but then as you put it on it stretches and opens up and so another thing that i really liked about this because it looked cute on the model it didn't look that material on the model but i was happy to get it in a different material because this is the material that i prefer so what i do love is that the ruffles are short i feel like that makes a huge difference the peplum is not long because i feel like when you have a long peplum on a shirt it can make you look bigger than what you are and accentuate the wrong area but when the peplum when the peplum is smaller i feel like it gives a more flattering look it looks way cuter like and even the even the wrist because it's more of a ruffle look instead of a bell like the past sweater i showed you was more of a bell this is shorter and it gives more of a ruffle look and it just looks so cute it looks so stinking cute and i i think i want to get some more of these in more colors because i got this in a medium and it gives like the it's like a crop it's it's a crop top basically and just the peplum on it is just really flattering and i believe that's because it's short and it waves a lot so usually peplums they're like big waves these are small waves and it's shorter so it's so cute this was my favorite out of the whole thing because i didn't expect for this to be this cute i really did so that's why i had to do it last <laughs> that's why i do it last i absolutely love this top and that is the end 
of this haul. All right, you guys, thank you so much, so much, so much for tuning into this fall trial haul. I hope you all enjoyed it. Once again, everything that I got was in a size medium. I'm 5'3 and 175 pounds, okay? So if you are new here, I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you go check out some more videos. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And don't forget, all of these pieces of clothing will be linked in the description box so y'all can go how. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. And I will see you guys in the next video.